Rick and Courtney, good evening to you both. And I tell you what, the love was really shared in a variety of film and television projects here at the Screen Actors Guild Awards. Will Smith took home for Best Actor, which I think may well be a precursor to what happens at both Critics' Choice Awards and the Oscars for his performance in King Richard Will with a rousing, rousing speech. Uh, also, obviously, a very, very uh, indelible performance there. So good evening for Will. That wasn't a surprise. This was Jessica Chastain for The Eyes of Tammy Faye. This is not a widely seen movie. Her portrayal of Tammy Faye Baker is extraordinarily vivid. It really is something and obviously was recognized by her peers in the Screen Actors Guild. The movie has has not been widely seen amongst regular moviegoers, but enough Screen Actors Guild members saw it to get Jessica to the podium tonight. To television and limited series, Michael Keaton, incredibly strong in the story of opioid abuse in Dope Sick, and Michael Keaton told an extraordinarily heartfelt story on the podium tonight about how the opiate crisis had affected his own family. It's a re really, really memorable, memorable moment. Kate Winslet wasn't here at the awards, but she was uh, a recipient of an award for her work, of course, in uh, the terrific mayor of Easttown. So Kate Winslet helping to present an award to Helen Mirren and then receiving an award herself for that work at mayor of Easttown. Maybe the biggest eruption of the night went for a show that we had a good feeling about going in. People enjoy HBO's succession tremendously. This third season has been the best season yet. We spoke with the cast on their way into the Screen Actors Guild Awards. All right, you guys kind of walk in here, and you, this is the blessing or the burden. I think people think you're going to win. Uh, well, I don't think it's a slam dunk just because it's uh, uh, an amazing uh, group of people. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. So uh, a lot of people have, are very excited by uh, the Squid Games, mm -hmm. and rightfully so. And um, it's thrilling to be here, and whatever happens, happens. Um, I don't know if we are you know, favored, but it's definitely an honor to be here, an honor to be nominated. Well, it's exciting. I, don't, I try not to think about that at all. I was following all the Squid um, Game people thinking, oh, I don't know. <laughs> and all, all the productions that are nominated this year are very exciting. I'm a fan of all of them. Yes, I mean, I would love for us to win, but it's not up to me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I tell you what, Alan Ruck, uh, Squ uh, Succession did win the best ensemble. That would be, I think, the top category a television project could win. An extraordinary number of actor awards handed out to the entire cast of Succession, almost all of whom who were here tonight. Squid Game was mentioned and Squid Game was represented. Two big wins for Squid Games. And backstage, we spoke to those two stars. We talked, yeah. and you said your heart was going to, you were going to fall down. You haven't fallen down yet. Not yet, <laughs> I guess. Almost, almost, but yeah. What a night, right? <laughs> An extraordinary night for both of you. Yes. Congratulations to you. When you heard your name called, what did you think? Well, speech do, credo, mo, jumbire heso chimanan, ansangbul, badasu, speech, jumbire so, jonyo yoka ga opsosu. I was in disbelief. I mean, almost to the extent I couldn't get up from my chair. And I had written a speech, but it was actually for the Ensemble Award, so I really couldn't say anything that I had prepared up there. Well, I tell you what, they both had an opportunity to speak on the podium. Uh, big, big winners tonight. The final award of the night, and I tell you what, a bit of prognostication from the red carpet. I thought Coda, which arguably is the most uplifting of all these movies, would have a good night tonight. It did. Troy Kotzer winning Best Supporting Actor and then Best Ensemble Cast. That's the equivalent here of Best Picture. Going to Coda, Marley Matlin literally uh, in tears. It was an extraordinary moment on the podium. I'm quite confident they will come backstage and we'll hear from them in a little bit. But Coda, another huge winner tonight. The SAG Awards in the book. The big award shows are back. Critics' Choice Awards here on KTLA in two weeks. The Oscars are just a month away. We'll go back to the two of you in Hollywood.